my god, it's Metal Gear Solid 2 Revenge of the Metal Gear Sons of Liberty. Okay. Oh yeah, they got the weird control scheme where X is back and circle is accept. I think that's Japanese style. Probably just leave everything default. Okay, Metal Gear Solid 2. So I played a, a very tiny bit of this game years ago, like probably over 10 years ago, um, at a friend's house, and I basically just did the opening mission, so that's as far as I've ever gotten, but that was a long time ago, so we'll see how long it takes us to get back into this. This is a circle game futility, you're right, you're correct. Normal, baby. I didn't even remember Metal Gear Solid had difficulty options. I'll just do Type 2, that seems to be the default. I think it's you don't get your radar once you're in intrusion because the whole point is that they're like blocking your radar. So that seems fair. Story is fictional. Any and all similarities to characters, groups, or other entities in real life are coincidental. Remember that. The Hudson River, two years ago. We uh, had classified intelligence that a new type of metal gear was scheduled gear. for transport. The whole thing stank, but our Stinky. noses have been out in the cold too long. Metal gear stinky. George Washington Bridge. Where is George Washington Bridge located? In the Hudson River? Ah, my eyes! Dude, it raining. It's raining, raining. So this game is a 4x3 aspect ratio, but the cutscenes have a widescreen wide letterbox, so that's why it looks like that, in case you're wondering. thought I'd see Snake wearing a rain poncho. Metal gear, he says as he tosses his cigarette. Yo, so he must have did the Otacon ed ending, because you get the invisibility item if you do the Otacon ending in Metal Gear Solid 1, Twin Snakes, so... Yo, he's doing the Golden Eye, the dam, the end of the dam level. Dude, nice reference. Electrocuted because of the rain. Let's 
so Toyota? Yo, it's Revolver Ocelot. How's this, how did he get his hand back? I thought Gray Fox cut your hand off. Like how he's just flipping his gun around for fun like while in a helicopter. He just can't help himself. Better gear solid tool, Sons of Liberty. David Hader is Solid Snake. Yo, I recognize that. This is Snake. Do you read me, Otacon? Dude. Loud and clear, Snake. Kept you waiting, huh? I'm Kept you waiting, huh? So that's Everything what it's from. Okay? Stealth camo's busted. Landing impact. We must have overused it. Sorry, but you're gonna have to deal with it. You're not in the military anymore. Right. I didn't plan on relying on this gadget anyway. The yeah. private sector's not so bad, is it? Privacy guaranteed? I'm happy as long as no one gives me any more unwanted gifts. You mean that thing with Naomi? And I can't say I miss the chattering nanny. Mei Ling's not so bad. And that reminds me, I have to get in touch with her again about that new Natick flashware. Diverting toys from the SSCEN again? Look, give her a message from me. Someone will find out, sooner or later. She's better off assuming it's sooner and quit while she's safe. Too true. Okay, Snake, Too let's true. get to work. You know how the technical specs of Metal Gear were sold on the black market after Shadow Moses? All Ocelot's doing. Exactly. And now every state, group, and dot-com has its own version of Metal Gear. Com. Not exactly a classified weapon for today's nuclear powers. This new one seems to have been designed to wipe the floor with all the other models. The only consistent description is that it's an Dude, now everyone has a Metal Gear. Metal Gear vehicle. That explains why this one is under Marine Corps jurisdiction. The mission objective is to make visual confirmation of the new Metal Gear being transported by that tanker and bring back photographic evidence. But I want you first to go up to the top level of the infrastructure, to the bridge. We need to find out where the tanker is headed. A little reconnaissance, huh? There's too much we don't know about this new prototype. Capabilities, deployment method, we don't even know how close it is to completion. If we know where the testing arena is, I can start to draw some reasonable conclusions. All right, I'll head to the bridge ASAP. Try to avoid confrontations. Our goal is to collect evidence on Metal Gear development and expose it to the world. It would be best if you could get out of there without alerting anyone. Don't worry, I know the drill. We're not terrorists. Very good. Don't you forget that you're part of Philanthropy now, an anti-Metal Gear organization anti -Metal and Gear organization. by the UN. Recognized, but still fringe, Otacon. Dude, I can't believe Meryl's dead. All right, let's look at your gear. In the true canon. Your weapon is a tranquilizer gun converted <clears> from a Beretta <throat> M92F. M9. It's a little hard to work with because you have to reload after each shot since the slide locks. Better than scavenging at the mission site. Good suppressor, too. The chemical stun will take effect in a few seconds and last for hours. You can take a weird the tutorial. Like, they're talking check out the laser sighting too. while they're showing the stuff. The anesthetic round will vary depending on what part of the body is hit. We're talking about a difference of tens of seconds between hitting limbs, chest, or head. As for the equipment... Hey, Snake? Cigarettes? What's wrong with you? It's kind of a lucky charm. You haven't read the Surgeon General's I'm addicted. Warning, have you? Yeah, this would be a hard, hard game to understand for a kid. The same way as your old one. <clears throat> I don't really remember anything about the story, honestly. Just from the little bit I played. So this is, you know, pretty fresh for me. They don't look armed. Hey, Earth to Snake. These are nice, upstanding Marines, not terrorists. Don't get caught. You're in stealth mode here. Sure, and if it comes to that, a little beauty sleep never hurt anyone. By the way, Otacon, are you sure of this intelligence? Absolutely. Hacked it out of the Pentagon's classified files myself. No traces? Oh, You're elite hacker? For that. But this might be a trap. Remember, there's a price on our heads. You're just being paranoid. I hope so. Those men, you wouldn't think they were anything but civilians from here. With all the ships passing on the river and in the harbor, 
Putting uniformed marines on the deck would be a bad idea. People can get a clear view of the water from Riverside, too. The water line is too high. According to the navigational plans, this ship should have discharged its cargo upriver. It's in there, no doubt about it. The military trains you to watch for threats from the stern on a boat. That's SOP for counter-terror ops, too. Security should be tighter. You worry too much. Where's the target? Satellite surveillance is a major international pastime these days. I'd say the cargo holds, safely below the deck. Do you see the entrance to the holds? Looks like there are a few entryways into the crew quarters. The chopper... Ocelot's just flying around. What? Oh no. He cut his ear so hard it bled through the hood. Jeez, who is this guy? Psycho? Oh yeah, fact. For sure, I'm hyped. Looks like we're not the only ones after Metal Gear tonight. Is that Might as well just call it Metal started? Snake a Adventure. Probably another cavalry. It's their game. Hijack? They're probably targeting the ship's controls. Otacon, how many men do you need to take over a tanker of this size? At least two. Run by a computer, so I'd say about 18 people. Back, we figured out that this game can't canonically takes place after the Otacon ending of Twin Snakes. Because Snake had the invisibility item that you only get if you do the Otacon Russians? ending. Which means he let Meryl die. Sure? It's kind of messed no up. Marine barber touched that head of hair. <sighs> He's Russian. Look at that hat. Who is this guy? He looks goofy. He looks like Old Snake, kind of. He kind of looked like Old Snake from 4. Maybe this is a weird, like, metaverse, uh, multiverse. It looks like the danger is theirs now. <clears throat> K60 Kasatka. Kasatka? Kasatka. Kamov Chopper, right? Killer Whale. We need to get a fix on who they are. Judging by their transport, aren't they some kind of military commandos? Not necessarily. It could be the KA-62, the civil model. Look, Snake, all we need is the photographic evidence of Metal Gear. As long as we have those, we can put it online and blow the whole thing wide open. So Dude, no we're gonna cancel them. Things, okay? All right, I'll do my best. Snake, we're gonna have, Moses. we're gonna start Which a hashtag so happens. powerful the it'll take them down. How can I check in and save my progress? I'll do it. There's a frequency set aside for it. 140.96. Sorry, but no. Oh, I just about to time. say, how about maybe? Call me on the codec when you want to save. Got it. I'll be waiting just past the Verrazano Bridge. You need to be off that ship by then. I'll be in touch. That's a good point. The solid is supposed to be for Solid Snake. So I guess it means we'll be Solid Snake the whole time. Let me try to remember. Okay, so it's R2 to pick your weapon. Yeah, so uh, this is like the only game I know that does it like that. You hold a button to aim and then let release that button to shoot. I remember the first time I played. I was so confused. How do we do first person peel? Oh, okay, R1. Ah, oh, the swivel. It's so weird. But that's just how it is, man. This game's weird with its... Metal Gear Solid just does not play like any other game. You've seen that in a lot of games that focus on a bow and arrow. On a bow and arrow, it definitely makes more sense because you the pullback and then the release, like you would be releasing to fire. But when you're firing a gun, you're pulling the trigger to fire, so it doesn't really make sense to release to fire, but... It is what it is. Who was that? Oh, like... Really, like, climb... Over... There we go. 
Oh, jeez. I guess I'm supposed to hold triangle, maybe, to like, hang? I'm still learning the controls. Relearning the controls. Okay, I'm gonna hold the button. Oh, but when I held it, I went right back up. I'm not gonna press anything. Yeah, if you don't press anything, you fall. But if you hold it, you climb back up. So how do you hang without falling? Let's hold the button. Yeah, then you pull yourself back up. Okay. How the heck do you hang? Huh, I don't know how to hang. Unless you can't hang there because it's raining or something. That's the only thing I can think of. Oh, there we go. I was trying to triangle in there before, but maybe... I don't know. Okay. Cool. Chaff grenade. That's for interrupting el electronic devices, I'm pretty sure. Oh, gee, someone's up there. That's just locked. Hello? Snake, it looks like that door can't be opened from the deck. You can infiltrate the ship through other doors. Okay. Oh, great. Now, how do you grab people from behind? Damn it. I probably mentioned this before, but I never learned how to grab people in, in Metal Gear Solid 1 the first time I played through it. And I forgot how to do it here as well. What do you want? It went off and then... Oh. Hello? Here we go. Snake, go through that door into the ship's interior. Push the action button down in front of the door and wait until the door opens before letting go. If you need to open the door faster, hit the action button repeatedly while you turn the handle. Okay, Make I'll just sure do that every time. Until the doors open. Wait, action button. Triangle then, okay. I did it. I opened the door. <laughs> Snaked in it, so I love you. Dude, look, I'm dripping wet. That's the real, the, uh, the detail of a Metal Gear Solid game. Is there an item down here? There we go. Okay, that's just blocked off. Now, how do you peek around corners? Was it art? Oh, jeez. Right. Press square without holding a weapon to choke. That's what I tried to do, because... No, oh no, I press circle, my bad. The circles shoot. You'd, you'd think square would be a uh, punch, because it would be in most other games. Oh god, I'm stuck. Like, I can't not fire right now. I had to fire. So if you're, here, let me explain. So if you hold down uh, square, you're aiming and releasing will fire. And the only way I know how to save that bullet is if you go here and then unequip it. But it wasn't letting me open that menu when I was against the wall. I was trying R2 on the corner to peek. It's not, it's not letting me. Cause R2 is how I bring this up, see? Which it didn't make any sense to me that R2 would be that. Okay. Oh, okay. Hitting R2 also makes you unequip your weapon. There it is. Okay, it's probably because I was tapping it instead of holding it. You have to hold it. If you tap it, you'll put your weapon away. Okay. 
That's good to know. We'll we'll figure out all the controls eventually. You're not gonna look around the corner, are you? I wanna. It's too late. Oh wow, he went quick. Usually you have to headshot someone to make them fall asleep that quickly. Oops. Let's see if I remember how to. Oh, that's right. You said I had to not hold a weapon, but I was holding my gun. Now, how do I pick you up? There we go. Drop stuff. Damn it. In Twin Snakes, if you picked up a body and dropped it, like, items would shoot out, but... Maybe he just doesn't have any items on him. And I know that Twin Snakes is based off this game's engine. So I'm assuming there's gonna be a lot of similarities. Okay, Chaff Grenade could take that out, or I can just try to avoid its sight. Oh, I should be saving too. I forgot this game manually saves. Hang on. Before I make any dumb mistakes. Wasn't it 96 or was it 40 96? You want to save Snake? There we go. Oh, you're not going to save. Damn well, it. Okay, just let me know. Time to save. Metal Gear Solid was the only uh Japanese game that refused to change the the input and the uh Decline, the confirm and the decline buttons. Because in this circle is confirm and X is decline. Okay, see you, snake. Which I believe is like more of a Japanese thing. But usually, for most American or even like Japanese PlayStation games that came to America, usually X is confirm and circle would be decline. But they 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 just kept it. Yeah, circle is confirm. Circle is also punch. It's just, it's always been like that with Metal Gear Solid. It's just they they say adapt or die, Americans. How do I open? Is that oh it's a ration hell yeah there we go. I wonder if we even had any rations to begin with also up makes the list go down and down makes the list go up Which I don't remember if it was like that in twin six or not but like I'm usually not a big fan of like that inverted type of uh, menu selection. Pikmin 3 had that, where left made the, made it go right and right made it go left and it drove me crazy and then Pikmin 4 got rid of that. I saw him walk that way on the map. Oh no, they're in a whole nother room. Oh jeez. Automatic door. Okay. Yes? Snake, wait! Don't move! Uh -oh. I see it. Some kind of device on both sides of the hall. Yeah, I totally Infrared saw it. Sensors? Right, and they're linked to... Let me guess. 
Semtex. Oh yeah, Semtex. Plastic explosives. If you trip the sensors, I'll be sleeping with the fishes along with this entire ship. That's a horrible defense mechanism. There aren't that many infrared beams. If someone Maybe runs into those, the whole ship goes down. Off the explosives. If you need to see exactly where the beams are, you can use the usual method. Smoking cigarettes. There's a fire extinguisher over oh. there. Break it open and Never try mind. scattering some of the extinguishing chemicals. You can use your cigarettes to see the lasers as well, though. That's a very... Wait, so is that the one with the red lasers? Which... Oh no, that's where the fire extinguisher is. But look at that. That's definitely a trap or something. I don't trust that. Wait a second! He said go get the fire extinguisher so you can see the lasers and the fire extinguisher is behind the thing where the lasers were. See, I was thinking maybe that the lasers he meant the other direction only because I saw the fire extinguisher right there. I think, I think Ocelot just killed us on purpose. He's a psycho. Okay, we found a box. Oh, what's that? Uh-oh. What's this guy doing? Well, he literally said go use that fire extinguisher right there, and I couldn't find one in the other direction. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Ah. Uh Wait, how come I'm not diving? Can you not dive in this one? Oh, it's with X. Just blow up again. <laughs> Screw it. What's going on? Snake! Snake! This is probably just like every other Metal Gear Solid game where the first mission is the hardest thing in the whole game. And then it just slowly gets easier as you go on. Okay, now let, let's let's um try the box out this time. Should be coming in here, right? Decided not to walk in this time. Yeah, I thought that was a key. Oh, what? Where'd my box go? What the heck? The cutscene took my box away. What the hell is this nonsense? Okay. That's dirty. I can't believe they did that. Don't, you don't need to check anything out. Everything's fine over here. They can't find him. Hell yeah. I didn't even have to hide the body. Oh, he. Where's he go? Got up. Quick. It doesn't look like there's any other way to go in here, though. 
Oh wait, there's another door, I see. Okay, hopefully- okay, alright. Sure, that works. Good old Metal Gear Solid cutscenes. Hey Miguel, did you show up for the Metal Gear? Uh, there's flat textures on this computer. Snake, did you find out where that ship is headed? No, I'm looking at it. 35 degrees longitude, latitude around 58. More than 500 miles off the coast of the Bermudas, out in the middle of the Atlantic. So the prototype is ready for solo testing. It's basically combat worthy. That area is outside the Second Fleet's operational range, too. It must be a standalone Marine Corps project, which means this prototype Metal Gear must be designed for independent deployment without any naval assistance. Metal Gear. Anyway, analysis can wait till later. Snake. Yeah, fact. Everyone, hold and everyone, and weapon. their mom has a Metal Gear now, apparently, because Ocelot sold the blueprints after the first game. And we're trying to find evidence of a, it's like a special Metal Gear being transported by this boat that apparently is like able, it's gonna wipe the floor with all the other Metal Gears. Get USP first. So there's a gun I missed. I wonder if it was behind the bomb thing. <sighs> okay, I need to go back down there because I have this feeling, maybe I should save first. But I have this feeling I was supposed to get past the laser bomb thing because there's a bomb there. That's probably where I get my first actual gun. Uh, but let's save in case I screw up. Gosh. Keep pressing X to try to call, but that's close. Oh, you need to save? Just a second. No, Otacon didn't s sell the blueprints. Ocelot did. Otacon's the, the weeb. Ocelot's the guy who likes spinning his, his gun around. Look at me spin my gun, Snake. Snake, you of course know the saying, one for all, all for one. What is this all of a sudden? Oh, I figured you'd need a lot of motivation, so I came prepared. It's from the Three Musketeers. The book, not the candy bar. Anyway, yeah. that if you go up against everyone by yourself, they'll gang up on you too, I think. Since you're on your own on that ship, you need to take this to heart and avoid confrontations. Iron Cogwheel. How is that? Just like the old days, huh? Almost reminds me of Mayweather. Yeah. But you sure you got it right? Of course. And I'll teach you a lot more of these. You can count on it. Great. Yeah. No, I I know that fact, but there is a there may in, in fact be a boss fight in which I may want to have an actual gun. Hint hint. Wait a second. No, no, this just leads down here. Did 
Did they mean for me to just shoot the fire extinguisher, even though it's I'm using tranquilizer? Would a tranquilizer dart pierce a fire extinguisher? Oh well, I'm not gonna question. Maybe I was put. I could have found the gun somewhere else. Control room, communication, and engine room are under control. All entry and exit points to the tanker hold secured. Infrared sensors placed and operational. Good work. Are the explosives in place? I guess yes, we're going the mercy right. route Listen, since I just have a tank gun. And the vehicle's pilot. He's the only one the vehicle's pilot. The VR training. No one else can do it. Are you sure you can trust him? Yeah, I don't know, Miguel. This is my first time. Gonna be the first time no, playing through this. Not over yet. I can see the moon, even in this storm, pale as death. I have a bad feeling about this mission. You swore this to me that you would leave the unit once the mission was complete. Do not worry. This is a country of liberty. No, this is where I belong with the unit. I have nowhere else to go. Father. I want to stay and fight. There is no choice to make here, Olga. Need I remind you that you are carrying my grandchild? You will be on the helicopter out of here now. Damn it. I don't know. I think there's at least two timelines. There's the Otacon ending timeline and the Meryl ending timeline in Metal Gear Solid 1. He doesn't want to go. Or I'll trank dart you. Toss your gun overboard slowly. A woman, show your face. You men, you're all the same. Who are you? Olga Golkovic. We are nomads, wanderers. So you shoot women too. I'm a nomad too. What else do you have there? Take the knife and toss it. Not there. Toss it overboard. I like how we could just see there's another gun on, on Hold that her position. back. Now, turn around. You know what you're doing. Uh-oh, that don't sound good. Hey, stop raining. Do the pseudo-reference in the background. Not too shabby, is it? New York, I mean. Whoa. They, they really had that Matrix time dodge. This would have been shortly after the Matrix came out, I'm pretty sure. And that brings our tour to its conclusion. Scout knife with a surprise. You are spat, Snaz. I think you deserve a little credit. No one's ever dodged that shot of mine. But no one gets lucky twice either. Did it just slow down for a second? Did anyone else hear that? Okay, here we go. Probably put this rush in. Hand. since I was born. I grew up on the battlefield. Conflict and victory were my parents. The youth oh. is my life. My family. We share everything. All the bad and all the good. I have no one. Nothing except the unit. Nothing else matters to me. Get your head out. Oh no! 
That's not good. Whoever you are, you're not stopping us. It is slow. It is. It does have some slowdown happening. I could tell. That's not good. Why does that happen? I might have to look into that. I've never had a PS2 game do that. I need to figure out how to get over there because she's not giving her position away. See real quick if I could fix why it's fix whatever the heck's going on because it is doing a weird slowdown. Let's see. Um, let's see, it shouldn't be the arrow thing. Because that was like for PS3. Was that for PS3 or was that GameCube? Maybe that was GameCube. Uh, I mean, I could try and see. Let's see, video. Enter. I can't see anything in the settings that might help. Because sometimes if you change like the which graphics card you're using or whatever. Wing. Those la that last four uh, characters, the Katakana's wing. Okay, sorry, I'm just gonna try to deal with this. I don't know how I can get over here. Okay, <laughs> nice cartwheel. I'm bleeding, I need to... There we go. Come on. He never reveals her position when I'm aiming. Oh, of course, as soon as I let go. Headshot does a lot. I'm using PCX2 or something. L let me check again. Because it is like, it is kind of bad. PCSX2. And it's version 1.6, which I assume is the latest one. They don't explain what any of these options are, so I don't know. Like, I'm looking through the thing and there's like, Recomplier, ent Interpreter, Emotion Engine, IOP, like, I don't know what any of these... Oh, hang on, if I scroll over it... Pretty so provided for diagnostic purposes only.
Um, the aspect ratio. Wait for VSync to refresh. Disabled. Let me try um something simple. Let me try full screening this. See if that does anything. I can already hear it still slow motioning. She went back there now. Even at oh I hit her somehow. What the heck? I hit her like I heard her go oh. I must have hit her through the the curtain somehow. That's funny. Nope. I can only really get like one hit before she... Yay! She shot it away herself. Oh, now she put a glare. Ow, rude. Oh jeez! Saw it right up in our POV. Ah. Sorry guys. There we go. We tranquilized her to death. No, we did the mercy. In a lot of these games you could just trank the bosses. But I did the, the cutscene, who knows what's gonna happen. I actually streamed Metal Gear Rising already. Yeah. I think that was like, what, like a couple years ago? Hmm. Yo, it's that thing Snake uses in Smash Bros, his, his up B. Cypher? Cypher, no swiping. Otacon, the ship appears to be under their control. The men have Russian gear, but I haven't been able to find out anything else about their origin. I know who they are. He had a funny Dude. Russian hat. Who ID the old man? Who is he? Sergei Gerlukovich. Gerlukovich? One of Ocelot's allies. The lurker. You can't just make up names, Otacon. Yeah, the group. That's not a real word. He's the one Ocelot was supposed to meet up with after Shadow Moses. They're after Metal Gear. Everything's changed. This is not going to be as simple as we thought. You could say that. I saw a surveillance remote just now. It looked like the Cypher. A Marine Cypher T? No, Army. First the Marines, then the Russians, now the Army? What's You're next? Right. This isn't gonna be simple. Snake, there's something I have to tell you. What? We didn't dig up this info about the new Metal Gear on our own. Not like usual. How did you find out then? It was a tip. An anonymous tip. Anonymous? You've never trusted those. Why would you start now? I, uh... I have a younger sister. A stepsister. We have different parents. I only knew her for two years. You've never mentioned her before. So? I feel like I know this. The sender of the tip was E.E. E.E.? E. E. Her name is Emma, but I always call her E.E. E. Emma? Emmerich? Yeah. It just caught my eye, you know? E.E. E. isn't the best nickname. I figured it was a nickname. coincidence, but I couldn't get it out of my mind. There's really no one out there who knows about her. When was the last time you saw her? Over ten years ago. You think it's a trap to lure us out here? I don't know. After I got the tip, I did break into the Pentagon system to get confirmation. 
Okay. Watch your back, Snake. Maybe I screwed up. I've got a light-equipped USP. I can take them on now. There's no ammo, but it takes a 9mm, just like the Marine's M9. I'll find those somewhere around here. Don't raise too much racket with that thing. I hear you. It's only 7, uh, 40 p.m. Because I'm on the west coast. Man, I think it's just this rainy area. Hopefully, uh... It stops lagging after this bit. Uh-oh. Missing my shot. He's just gonna keep going in circles, it looks like, so I'll just wait for him again. I get him? There we go. A wet box. Ugh. Well, we're not gonna be able to use a wet box indoors. So why is this box wet? USP bullet. Now I have a USP. When did I get that? In the cutscene? Because I took it from her technically? Okay. We, we went out there to fight her, so where are we, where are we trying to go now? Oh, we're still trying to get- that was just a fight. We still need to get evidence that the Metal Gear is here. I wonder if I wasn't supposed to come back in. Yeah, let's go back outside. I guess. Can I go back outside? So I'll have to go this way again. Yeah, from Olga. Probably up here. The giant robot sized footprints, right? Let's go up here, this ladder, why not? Snake Eater! Look at him climb! Thermal goggles, hell yeah. Oh my god. Virtual boy mode. Turn that off for a second. Also, I should save, I just did that boss fight. Oh, Snake, you wanna save? I'm pretty sure on the GameCube, uh, Twin Snakes, you do press A to confirm some things, which is why this has taken me a while to get used to. Okay, there's a saying that goes, even a bird on high dies a glutton's death, as do the fish of the deeps. The lesson is, uh, don't be greedy. The fish that belonged to a family called the deeps died from overfeeding, and so did a bird that got high on something, probably fermented fruit. Wow. Okay. You say so. <laughs> I do, Snake. Don't I do. Take unnecessary risks just because you're greedy for more items. Remember the deep family's fish. His uh, his proverbs are not quite as uh polished as Mei Ling's were, but he's trying. That's how you'd climb a ladder. The dude's still sleeping in the background. Let's see. 
So that leads back inside, so maybe... And this is still dead end as well. Maybe it is time to just go back inside and then we'll find like another path or something. Alright. Just seemed like this guy would have been guarding something. quarters. This is where the crew keeps all their quarters for when they go to the arcade. Let's try our theory. But what good does that do? I mean, we already knew we couldn't go through that. Oh, damn, did the camera see me? I'm just gonna stay in here for a second. Just in time, geez, unless he decides to open it. Sometimes they do. God damn it. I didn't make any noise. I just ducked and then got back up. Come on, you dummy. Go away. going the right way because this is back where we came in from but ah oh, damn it because I don't have a radar now ah Oh, that doesn't open anyways. Damn it. What the heck? Go to sleep. Is this where I came in from? I need to lay on the ground to stop bleeding.
No, it is an instant, but if you look at earlier when I was sh shooting people with it, they were passing out, like, way faster. I had hit someone in the butt, and they tranked out instantly just a bit ago. So I guess it varies. But I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Because this is where we started. Oh! That, that helps steady your aim, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna call Otacon. Maybe he could tell me what I'm supposed to be doing. Whoops. Oh, you need to save? Just no, I didn't mean. Look, Snake. Hey, Snake. You found a handgun. Yeah, it's a decent one. USP. The USP fires real bullets. Dude, I, I know what a gun is. I want to know where to go next. What you're wielding right now is a convert. Oh my god. Okay, Otacon's useless. So Otacon said I could go through any other door except that one door. Yeah. Thought he wasn't lying. Well, I don't want to reload my save because I don't know if... I'm trying to figure out where I'm going. Kojima and his lingerie posters. Metal Gear Sleepy. Prob yeah, I think it's underneath, so you think we would want to be heading to a lower part of the ship. Oops. See, there. So I guess butt shots are the insta tranks. Yeah, today's fine. Had had my classes and got home and chilling. Had me a nice cheese burger for dinner. That's a different area. Dude, the butt shots, I'm telling you. Here we go. This is going farther down. Maybe this is where I need to go. Could have something to do with body armor. They're not protecting their butts very well. Yo, what is that? Raven. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. It looks like Raven, like was this big old minigun. It's gonna be something silly, isn't it? Oh! What the heck? It's a miniature of Raven! That's crazy. Who, who did this? Who set this up? What a troll. Is that another poster? Oh, what is that? Oh! <laughs> well... 
I guess that's... That's fair. They have the sexy women posters. They're allowed to have those too. Oh, jeez. Well. Walter's been fine. You're the one who put the, the raven statue like that? Oh jeez, can I... Oops, there we go. I just remember mashing that button and <laughs> did that, so... I think he's dead. I think we broke his neck. Oops. That's our first kill in the game, I think. Everyone else we just knocked out or tranked. The choking is funny, because that's the only way I know how to do it, is just you mash the button. Maybe there's a nicer way to do it, but I, I don't know. Butt shots. Uh-oh, I missed his butt. I dare you. Okay. Damn it, I meant to do the choke. Oh well. Oh jeez, well. Okay, that's two deaths. Two kills, I should say. Now he's gonna come back and Metal Gear Solid 4 is like... the, the main villain. No. You knocked me to my death, Snake. But I came back. That's true, they were killing civilians. I don't even have any rations prepared right now. I could have died at any moment. My health dropped. The red circle. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, I panicked. I thought he was gonna turn around and see me. This guy remembered to armor his butt. Whoops. I did not mean to I did not mean to teabag. I'm trying to pick him up to see if anyone has items you can get. So far, it doesn't seem like it. Okay, I can't. Otacon claimed they were civilians. Because we weren't supposed to let anyone see us or take any lethal action. We were just trying to get a picture. Were they Marines? Oh, jeez. Nope. Shut up. Yeah, you better fall asleep. What's going on here? I could just slid out. Repair of the entrance way to the engine room on the port side is complete. We'll return to position five. <laughs> Send the replacement guard for the area. We're full of our uh, actual gun. Just haven't had to use it. Okay, that's. That's funny. The outside had the front, and then the inside has the back. Huh? 
Snake, wait, don't move. Oh, that's right. They were dressed like civilians. On both sides of the hall. Infrared sensors? Right. And they're linked to... Let me guess. Semtex. Exactly. Plastic explosives. So this is what they were talking about. Looks like it. If you trip the sensors... I'll be sleeping with the fishes, along with this entire ship. That sounds about right. I'm Wait. He's just doing the dialogue from before because it's our first time encountering it this time, I guess. Dude, who's making noise? Um... What was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, but Otacon did say to not kill anybody still, cause uh... I wonder if I need to use a real- Oh, I could use a chaff grenade probably. First off, let me see if having a cigarette lets you see it. It should. Yep, okay. Now, man, that drains your health quick. Okay. So, let's see if a chaff grenade might do the trick. Keep it. Oh, thermal goggles, good idea. Because we did find those, good point. Chaff grenade should. Okay. Nope, chaff grenade does not. Those things will kill you, you know, yeah. So. I don't think we could cr crawl under. We need to destroy. I think we just straight up need to shoot those with the real gun. The, uh, these spots, let's see. Nope. Surprised nobody heard that. I'm not sure... Hmm. Because it looks like it's showing you the boxes that are... Or I guess those are just the explosives themselves, huh? So, I should definitely shouldn't have been shooting that. Wait, can I climb? Mm. Let's see. Can't tell. No, I can't get under that. The lowest line is too low. I guess we just can't go this way. Instead of having a locked door, they decided to just... I don't think I should shoot it again. Okay. What about the dead guy I found in the locker? I don't know, he didn't have anything on him. I don't know if I'm supposed to do something with him. I could check, but I, I haven't figured out how to pick up. I've been having trouble picking up bodies. Wait, was he in this room? No, that was another room, wasn't it? Or was he? Yeah, I don't, I'm pretty sure that's, I think that's just a dead end. I think it's just kind of a convoluted dead end. Cause there was already that other laser point where there was just kind of no point to it. Like you just had to walk around it. I mean, that one was just like, okay, you have to walk around it. But this one I think is the same. Like, I don't. Freeze. No. Oh, how did I do that? I don't know what to do now, just shoot him in the butt. Okay, <laughs> that works. No! Freeze. Oh. 
That'll go outside, won't it? Every time we open one of those valve type doors. Oh, that's how you get the dog tags. I could never figure out how to do that. Because I don't know what buttons to press to like ask for them. I don't know who's in this game because I've only I've not I've not played through it yet. This is my first time playing through the game. Did I just leave the same way I came? That camera is not. On. Oh, it's just a light. That's why it's not on because it's not a camera. Oh. Oh, jabroni. Oh, come on. I know I hit him. Fall asleep. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that happened. Cool. Oh, jeez. Uh. Sorry, sir. Oh, did I just- I just went around all the way to the first place I went, didn't I? I'm an idiot. Because it was B- I'm pretty sure that's what that was. I need to go back to the A side. Hey, Mike. Mike, have you ever played Metal Gear Solid? Yeah, the, the choking sound is pretty funny. Wait, wait, wait. I wonder if Snake knocks himself out if he rolls down the stairs. Let's see. Yes! Yes! He does it in this one. I remember the first time I tried rolling down stairs in Twin Snakes and that happened and I was like, this is amazing. You never see games do that, because of course that's what would happen if you tried rolling downstairs. But then when I played Metal Gear Solid 4 at my friend's house, you could just roll downstairs and just it just does it like any other game, like you just roll, and it made me disappointed. Okay, I went that way before, so I need to come back this way. What? I just came from that side. So I gotta go back around again? Man, that's some... booty. I'll get to Metal Gear Solid 4 eventually. I played about... I played some of it. I want to say I was almost halfway through the game. Uh... Maybe at least halfway through the game, but that was a long time ago. And I actually own a copy of Metal Gear Solid 4 for PS3, but I don't have a PS3, unfortunately, to play it with. Um, Because I got it for like 99 cents. I think maybe even 89 cents I got it for at a GameStop. It was pretty crazy. Okay, we went downstairs last time. Let instead this time, let's go this way. Wait for that guy to come back around. Metal Gear Solid 4 is really disappointing for you in general. It's only five, is Metal Gear Solid 4 is only five levels? I remember it being pretty long. I remember the the cutscenes in that game were like especially long. What the heck? I just shot like a book down and I guess it got that guard's attention. That's kind of funny. But it like zoomed the camera like zoomed in. Hey, what is that guy sleeping on the ground for? 
Anyone else in here? Dude, more rations, which I don't have equipped again for some reason. How does it keep happening? I love this movie. Yo, look, they got a widescreen TV. Pants? Why has this guy got flies buzzing around him? Oh, he's already asleep. What the heck? Who is this guy? I feel bad for him. I don't want to kill him. He's just sleeping by him all by himself. Okay, so I'm back here again. So maybe I was supposed to find a way through here. I just... So yeah, there, I could see the lasers, but what? how does that help me? I still don't know. I still can't get through it. Let me call Otacron again. Maybe he'll be more useful. So you've got rations now. Dude, that's not the point. Snake, Metal Gear is in the holds below the tanker's deck. Go down. That USP of yours should let you take out the infrared booby traps. Wait. There's no way- I tried that though. I literally tried that. That was like one of the first things I did. Is I try to shoot the glowing boxes. Don't tell me. That's what I was supposed to be doing the whole time. Cool. Otacon wants us dead. This is the only explanation. I mean, this game has good checkpoints, thankfully, if you just load it in from another area. So what do they mean? Shoot this? Oh, that's not even the right gun. It just says your gun will make quick work of this. What do you mean, Otacon? Explain. Is that it down here? Snake, respond. Snake, snake. You need to be more clear. Do I just have to shoot every glowing thing until I figure out which one's the right glowing thing to shoot? Snake, respond. Snake, snake. I don't remember getting stuck here. I don't know if there's a con- I mean, there's that. Let me shoot the flower again. So I could actually see the lasers. But Otacon does not help. He's like, oh, your gun will make short work of the lasers. And it's like, okay, explain, please. I don't know. I don't know what you mean, Otacon. I'm gonna call him again and see if he says something else. Aim carefully and take out just the control unit from the infra. The one with the green light. Did I not shoot the one with the green light already? At least now he's being specific. Hey, first off, shut this. So I can freaking see better. Hello. 
that? Who's that guy? There it is. Could have sworn I shot that already. Otacon, you didn't tell me there was more than one. Shoot only the one thing with the green light. I'm telling you, Otacon wants Snake dead in this game. I don't know what brought on this change of heart. Shoot the glow with your big gun. That just turned off one of them. So where the hell's the other green glows at? I don't see any other... Does anyone else see where another green glowing device is? I don't. Oh! You can barely see it up there. You can barely see it. Only if you're standing on this. So now I can actually look up, now I could probably see the other one that I couldn't see before. The first one was just like, you had to be standing on top of that thing and then you also like could just barely see it if you look in the right spot. Where's this one at though? That it has like a little antenna. Maybe I need to like. Oops. Ah! Look, I literally had to. You had to duck. You had to crawl, rather. There we go. Wow, that is sneaky. Because I thought it looked like that might be one of them, but I couldn't see the glow, to be sure. Verrazano Bridge checkpoint passed. Oh. All non-essential personnel report to the holds in 10 minutes time for the scheduled briefing session with the Commandant. You are ordered to continue manning your posts until that time. So there must have been a green glow on that first uh, laser that we saw earlier. The crank handles. This is a long hallway. Hello, soldier. Oh, good idea. We should save. Oh, you need to save? Yep. 
You know what's funny? I only really remembered the boss fight. I don't even. I didn't remember this Another stuff. Chinese proverb: Those who look to the heavens prosper. Those who defy it are no more. Do you know this one? The meaning here is. Hold on a sec. Let me look at my notes. You can only survive as long as you're a part of the natural order of things. You remember pre-ripped jeans? Manufacturers thought that just because people loved old, broken-in jeans, they would want to buy new jeans that looked old. So they purposefully... What do jeans have to do with nature and order? Denim should fray you, and rip on its own. They had the uh, pre-ripped right? jeans so back in the early 2000s already? Oh, yeah, I guess no that sounds about right. Them. The earnings report from that fiscal year is enough of a proof. Earnings? That's so funny to me that, that that's a thing. What the heck? Look at this goofball. He's listening. <laughs> He's listening to music on the job and look what happened to him. falling asleep. I guess it's not just the foxhound uh, soldiers that are inept. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's one of the things that makes the game so special, right? There's all, like, these little details. How do I get that? Oh, I guess it's time to use a ration. Oh, here we go. Also under our control. Of course there's gonna be lots of shots of snakes, but Sir, the Marine Commander has started his speech already. We will complete the preparations before the end of the speech. All communications to the halls have been severed. No one is aware of our presence. Let no one down into the halls until we are out. Yes, sir. We will secure your exit with our lives if necessary. Yes, sir. My daughter, keep her safe. Yes, sir. Imagine if we had killed her already. They probably make it where you can only do that fight with a Trank, but now that I think about it. They didn't want you to kill her. Oh jeez! When did- Snake automatically went to his gun, I meant to pull- okay. I guess Trank time's over. Ouch. You guys need a little 
Ow. Man, how- what caliber are these guns? They just send Snake freaking launching back like I just got hit with a shotgun. Oh, jeez. Right, we got the actual handgun from Olga. What the hell? Okay, it must be designed for them to specifically do that. Damn, you're not dead yet. Oh, I think you did that. Oh, jeez. I need to stop bleeding! Holy crap, look at all these guys. Yeah, we have rations, it's fine. Oh my god, I'm also out of ammo. Oh well, I didn't really plan on using my gun, I just... They had me switch to that already. Whoops! Not oh, I guess we just had to take those guys out. Jeez, we wasted all of our handgun ammo. That's why they didn't want us to progress, because I was still part of the cutscene. So you were going to automatically get blasted back no matter what if you tried running up too far. Cowboy boots. Our sp oh, boot spurs. What the heck? It's, it's Ocelot. The what the Damn. Notice he's using his left hand to shoot and open the door. He got his right hand cut off in in a the first game. So does he have like a Colonel false right hand now? Comrade. I'm Revolver Astelat. Snake, are you in yet? Have you made it to the holds? It's taking longer than I expected. We've already passed the Verrazano Bridge. All right, we'll use another recovery point. They may be planning to change course. What? The exits to the deck are all sealed. What are they planning? If they get Metal Gear, we're going right off the fringe. You're all familiar with the Shadow Moses. The men down here are definitely brains. Oh, well, there's too many character models on the screen. It's slowing down. If the deck is sealed off, they have no way of knowing that the ship's been taken over. I'm not interested in fighting these guys. The weapons won't do me much good here. Clones? Can you see Metal Gear? No. I'll have to go around to the bow. They have some serious defenses here. I doubt the breeze and rivals want to blast their way through the Marines either. Wonder where they're headed. I don't know. Not the beach. That's for sure. <laughs> they just get drunk every once in a while. Okay, Snake. Let's go over this one more time. Use this camera to get photographic evidence of the Metal Gear prototype. Now do your thing and take pictures that speak louder than the government's plausible denials. We need four shots. Metal Gear from the front. Front right. I remember front this left, now, actually. And a close up of the Marine Corps marking. Marking? There should be a Marine's insignia on the body of Metal Gear. Just let someone try explaining away a clear shot of that. Why would they put their logo right. on there? There's this top secret thing. illegal device. Just spit it out. I'm used to things going wrong. It looks like someone's monitoring our transmission. Who? I don't have a clue. All they're doing is watching. It would creep me out less if they tried to interfere with our communications. Could it have something to do with that cipher we saw? 
Maybe. I've switched the encryption protocol for our burst transmission for now. What I want to do is use a different method for sending these photos, just in case. Instead of using the codec? Exactly. There's a workstation in the southeast corner of the block where Metal Gear is housed. I've made arrangements so that you can send the pictures from the machine. Arrangements? I hitched a ride on Link 16 into U.S. military's proprietary network, managed to get into that workstation, and overwrote a part of the system software so I could remote install a little app I wrote. Why bother with anything that complicated? No, it's pretty simple, really. Look, all you have to do is stand in front of the machine and push the action button. The app will automatically launch and download the image data from the camera, split the files, and encrypt them individually. The data packets can then masquerade as... Okay, okay. So all I have to do is push the action button in front of the computer once I have the pictures, right? Well, sure, if you put it that way. And one more thing. The That's how you put it. The already begun his speech, but you need to get the pictures before he's done talking. Otherwise, they'll spot you, okay? How much time do I have? I hacked into his personal files and took a look at the text of that speech. I'd say you have seven more minutes. Longer if he throws in a joke or two. <laughs> a seven-minute time limit, huh? Remember, Snake, just the photos, okay? With these kinds of odds, I won't be making any sudden moves. But that doesn't mean we can just let Metal Gear be hijacked. Okay, okay, but first the photos. All right, we'll deal with the rest when we get there. Stay low. Okay. At the moment, every industrialized nation on the globe knows the specifications for Metal Gear. Worse yet, so do a number of rogue states. They are all, all right, working on um... deploying their own Metal Gear force to compete with the U.S.'s nuclear strike capability. The Where's that dang Metal Gear at? The a swarm of these Metal Gear derivatives. We initiated development of Metal Gear Ray as a countermeasure to these pirated weapons forces. The only thing that can stand up to a Metal Gear is, of course, a I mean, the checkpoint will restart us here anyways, but I guess it's save just in case. Oh, you need to save? I thought you said OBS a lot at first, Chris. Hey, Wolf. Snake, what's hardest one? Most easily lost. It's time, get it? Except daylight savings time. Okay. With Ray, the hundreds, if not thousands, of metal gears that exist all over the world are no longer a threat. The blind rush to nuclear proliferation will be contained, and it will be the Marine Corps and now Ray. Why is one soldier in his boxers? Look at that guy. Ours is not the Nobody only notices. Project devoted to Metal Gear development. But it cannot be more different in nature from the Navy's. There's a program that will add fuel Where'd they go? to uncontrolled fire. I'm telling you, there was one of them was wearing boxers. A fact that players and you can't press down. Sometimes I do it, and sometimes I just start. I, I thought the Metal Gear was down here. Where the heck? Some say that the strategic. Oh! <laughs> Snake, you okay? Snake! Snake! Every single person. I knew I was supposed to duck underneath the projector. nation on the globe knows the specifications for Metal Gear. Worse yet, Whoops. so do a number of rogue states. They are all working on deploying their own Metal Gear force to compete with the U.S.'s nuclear strike capability. The world is about to see a swarm of these Metal Gear derivatives. We initiated development of Metal Gear Ray as a countermeasure to these pirated weapons forces. 
The only thing that can stand up to a Metal Gear is, of course, another Metal Gear. With Ray, the hundreds, if not thousands, of Metal Gears that exist all over the world are no longer a threat. The blind rush to nuclear proliferation will be contained, and it will be the Marine Corps and our Ray that will accomplish this. Ours is not the only military project devoted Whenever they're on screen, it just... But it cannot be more different in nature yeah. than the Navy's. There's the program that will add fuel to the Oh, wait. Was I not supposed to go this way? It is a fact that this is the dead end. Of such a policy are attempting to derail our own raid project. But I promise you that they will not succeed. I guess I need to keep going up left, maybe. Strategic importance of aircraft carriers will be reduced by the completion of raid. The opposition from the Navy is an undeniable fact. There is a lot of pressure from Navy brass, especially those with submarine and air background. Not to mention interference from a major player. But this project is vital to the Marine Corps. There we go. The enemy is sometimes closer to home. This weapon will render all other the metal heck? gears obsolete. Nations building up their own metal gear force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. Sorry, I'll try to fix the slowdown. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. Oh, it must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Right. They stopped. Left. Oh my God! I forgot about this part. Down. What? They were looking down. Ugh. Someone wasn't looking down when they were supposed to. What the heck's this? Oh, just an extra cutscene before you fell? Okay. Snake, respond! Snake! Snake! This weapon will render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear for. Damn it. Okay, okay. Snake, respond. Snake, snake. This weapon will render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. Be like right here. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. I wait for that other dude. It must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Right. Left. Down. Mm -hmm. Right. Oh no. No. Okay, so after they go down, they go right again, and I guess that's when we just want to make a run for it, I guess. Snake, snake. Looks like you barely will have any time. 
You th you'd think when they were looking down that would be the time, but they they saw me when I did that last time. Nations building up their own Metal Gear force will think twice. Okay. What's going on, Snake? Snake! This weapon will render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. Dude, stop. The shift in the balance of power. I can't believe you walked around all the way. Snake. Snake. That's dirty. I was going to try to choke him, but I was holding my gun out, but I couldn't do it. I need to wait for them to look right, I guess. Yeah, this part is getting annoying. This weapon will render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear Force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. Now I can't go right now because that soldier up there is looking this way. New world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. Must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? I'm gonna try to go for when they go right. Right. They take. Ah! You, you soldiers are horrible. When he says right, you should look right. Darn it! You have like barely enough time to make it, so I was trying to hurry. Nations building up their own Metal Gear Force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. God damn it. So I went to the left so that the slowdown when it happened, so like it would go a little quicker, but then somebody saw me. I can't do that. All other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear Force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world there you order. Go. I'll just look. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. There we go. You must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Right. Left. Wait, can I not fit right there? Oh, can I climb up on the box? Maybe I need to climb up on the box, and that's why there's a down. Because then while I'm up there, they'll be looking down. That's got to be what it is. It wasn't letting me climb on this one, though, so I don't know. It's not that I'm impatient, I just don't know the right thing to do I'm trying to figure out so what I'm doing exactly maybe I'm just to go this way nations building up their own metal gear force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray.
The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world. I was probably supposed to go to the right side the whole time. It looked like the left, like there was something I was supposed to do, though, so. I got kind of mixed up there. It must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Left. Down. Did it say right when we were on the left side? So it is dynamic. Left. I think that is the right idea, though. We at least got a little bit farther that time. I don't know where we're heading, though. And I still haven't seen the Metal Gear itself to take pictures of it. It's not, like, on the projection, right? That's not right. Have I- was I supposed to be taking pictures of the screen the whole time? I thought you take pictures of the actual Metal Gear. Because if that's the case, I'm gonna have to go back to the other room. What the heck? Is that an Easter egg? Hmm. I'm trying the balance to... of power will mean a new world order. We, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. Okay, I don't know. It is my greatest wish never to have her or her. Okay, close. Experience the horror of nuclear war. As a father, I want to leave a better world for the future. You saw that, right? Like the weird <laughs> image that As showed up. Soldier, I know that's my duty. Yeah, I figure it's got to be the actual Metal Gear. Must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Left. I don't trust this. Up. Up. Right. Down. You done? Oh, he's back with the speech. Okay. The National Missile Defense Program was initiated in the end of the 20th century. God. Snake, you okay? Snake. I still don't get where I'm even supposed to be going right now, because it looks like this just leads to a dead end. But where else do I go? Render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear Force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. Must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Don't say right, please. Left. Down or up. Down. There's there's no pictures to take yet, double O. I haven't found Metal Gear. I'm still looking for it. Down. Wait, yeah, this is a dead end. Why did I even come over here? To move on. I I'm so confused. I had I can't it find Metal Gear. Never to have her what was even the point of coming in here? Experience the horror. Snake, what's Snake. Snake. The console should be in the southeast. So the console's where I upload the pictures, but where where is Metal Gear itself for me to take the pictures? Oh, there's a door over there I could go into. Maybe I just need to go into that. 
light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. It doesn't help when I gotta go through slow motion mud. The shift in the balance of power. Oh, I should do that. Oh, you can't crawl while you're in first person. We, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. I don't know. I'm gonna go see if I could go through that door. I, I didn't see that there was a door there. You must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Where was that door at? Left. On this one? Where's the door at? I don't even see it here now. The d I swear we saw a door on the right, right? Because I don't see one now. Am I going insane? It's right there. How did we miss that? Is that not a door? Oh, it's just the side of that, of one of those blocks, but it looks like a door. What the? I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Wait, there's a hatch right there. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world Okay, it's not the hatch. I could see it on the radar. What can I see on the radar? There's a door up top somewhere? There's no ladder for me to climb up. I have a daughter. And it is my greatest wish never to have her or her children experience the horror of nuclear war. There, there is a door? I want to leave a better world for the future generation. As a soldier, I know that. There is a door north of the map. I'll try to look again, but like, I would have went into it if I saw it. I just didn't see it. There's a door up here? Oh! Oh my god. Ah! Of course. That only took us like 30 minutes when it should have took us 2 minutes. Jesus. First I was doing the left side over and over again, which wasn't even where we were supposed to go, and then... That it. The National Missile Defense Program was initiated in the end of the 20th century, projected to completion. That is the computer. However, the NMD trial conducted in the year 2000 was a complete Got a failure. picture on this side. The success of the 1999 trials is now considered a chance Good. Now we gotta get one on the other side. The technological solution in sight, and the program was already attracting strong criticism from Russia and China for its potential violation of the anti-ballistic missile agreement. The fact that any development in missile defense would trigger accelerated weapons development has been pointed out from the very beginning. Oops. Ah! Oh, okay, that guy's asleep standing. I guess that's fine. He has forced the NMD proposal through and succeeded in deploying Does this count? Did I just over... Okay, now. Okay, now I just need to get the With insignia. I assume. Metal Gear Ray is amphibious. Unlike the army's Rex, it can cruise deep underwater, move in undetected, and make its landing on any shore level. 
It's onboard joint tactical information. You might need to get like higher up or something. Identifies targets with unerring accuracy and takes them out with massive firepower. It is the ultimate weapon, and it is yours to guard. I'd like you all to think about what that means. Oops. Took left. We have intelligence that there are anti-Metal Gear terrorists planning to target the ship. Intruder to the right! Who saw me? Intruder in the back! <laughs> Intruder in the right! Intruder in the left! Three hops this time. Snake! Respond! Snake! Snake! Charlie Brown. The national missile what if this whole meeting, he just does that, he just starts doing the, the uh, that weird song. Oh, it still saved the pictures However, I took. So I just need to get the picture of the insignia now, which I don't know if it's like on the back or something. Otacon probably tells you and I forgot. There was no technological solution in sight, and the program was already attracting strong criticism from Russia and China for its potential violation of okay. the anti-ballistic missile agreement. Um. The fact that any development in missile defense would trigger accelerated development has been pointed out from the very beginning. What? What were you thinking? Snake! Snake! Oh, because you can't kill them because they're not bad guys. We're just trying to. S okay. The national missile defense. See, I told you, Otacon said not to kill them. In the end of the 20th century, projected to completion in 2005. However, the NMD trial conducted in the year 2000 was so a complete uh... failure. And the success of the. God damn it! Everyone else falls asleep instantly when they get shot in the butt, but not this guy. I guess we'll just headshot him. The National Missile Defense Program was initiated in the end of the 20th century, projected to completion in 2005. However, the NMD trial conducted in the year 2000 was a complete failure. There we go. And the success of the 1999 trials is now considered a chance happening. There was no technological solution in sight, and the program was already attracting strong criticism from Let me Russia see. and China for its potential Oops, that's not that. Of the anti ballistic missile, agreement. there it is. The fact that any development in missile defense would the highest resolution development has been pointed out from the very beginning. All right, and okay, now we got everything. President Sears forced the NMD proposal through and succeeded in deploying the program. Some say that it was a military interest with plans for the hundred billion dollar program budget that actually arranged the legislative approval. I like how this is conveniently just a computer right here. Right, for us to send the pictures. Loading MGX. Oh geez, there's probably have references in here. Password? Am I supposed to know the password? Okay. Scott. Login incorrect. Oh, I guess we figured it out. Or the auto thing figured it out. Do you think Snake's gonna also send the weird picture that showed up of that face? Otacon, I don't know what this is, but it popped up when I took the picture. Kinda creepy, huh? So, oh, it's any codec moments from you, Chibi Snake? Con. Okay, first up. Yeah, don't send me creepy stuff like oh. this. What if I get possessed or something? He actually Sorry, responded to it. Sorry, this doesn't work. I hate to ask, but can you try again? That's hilarious. Wow. They actually responded to it. That's great. And the next one is... Okay, that's good. The shot from the right is in the back. I should have took more pictures. I didn't know he was going to respond to, like, 
certain pictures like that. What's next? Okay, this works. It's a great front view. Wait, did I need a front, right, and then left? And I What's didn't get next? the left? This is great. The Marines lettering shows up really They're gonna well. make me go more to the left, aren't they? The last one is... I'm sorry. Damn it! I thought I I thought that was front left. My bad. I forgot there was just front and then there was front left. It can cruise deep underwater. Move in undetected and make its landing on any shoreline. You should just put the prompt in the agent. It would be funny if just the dial-up noises started playing. It's onboard joint Man, if I take a picture of like one of those lingerie posters, I bet you he would have said something. It's too late for that. It is the ultimate weapon. This is a horrible picture. It is yours to go. I wonder if I need to climb up a ladder or something. That means. The brain is my specialist in the black market trade and weapons trade plutonium. That works, right? Oh. Yep. All right. Yep, they made the noise. Add metal what do you think about the this article? World over. You once lived in the shadow of the Doomsday Machine. This Metal Gear Ray can bring other Metal Gears under control and ensure that we never know that fear again. We, the Marines, will be the Guardians. Yeah, the one that looked like one of the devs, too, yeah. This new model of Metal Gear is codenamed Ray. I feel like we found like the most secret one, ironically, by taking a picture of the screen like the way we did. But I'm kind of curious about what he says about any other pictures now. Looks like I have your photos now. Let's take a look. Okay, first up. You're a pretty good photographer. We can definitely use this left shot. It's so obscure. Okay, now we have all the photos. Oh, look at the other one. Snake, the speech is about to wind up. Forget the photos and get out of there now. Let me forget the photo. We, the Marines, will lead the charge into a new world We, the Marines, all took some sleeping rain. pills just before Let this speech. Dismissed. What if Snake just like saluted in like involuntarily? Who's slow clapping? Is it Ocelot? Excellent speech, my friend. Yep. Who the gift of the silver tongue? They say it's the mark of a good officer and of a liar. Americans are too in love with the sound of their own voice to speak the truth. Identify yourself. I am Shalashaska, also called Revolver, Revolver Ocelot. Ocelot. Okay. Do the PS1 version. Crazy how he's the only one of the do you Foxhound that survives the Shadow Moses this machine situation. Would be quite useful. What are you planning to do? Steal this thing? Steal? No, no. I'm taking it back. Yeah, he was the one who sold them the blueprints, I just realized. Or he sold it to the black market or whatever. So maybe he did it on purpose. So someone would make a better version, and then he would steal the better version. 
He was playing 3D chess, 4D chess the whole time. Whoa. It's not good. Gerluka bitch. Nobody move. Understood. <sighs> yeah, so lot that's kinda still stealing. This ship now carries enough Simtex on its key structural points to blow it out of the water at the touch of this button. Snake already did it a few times. That's right. No one has to die needlessly. What do you intend to do with Ray? Sell it on the streets? I was raised in Znezinsk, formerly known as Chelyabinsk 70, the nuclear research outpost. What are you talking about? After the Cold War ended, my home was bought out by the Americans. Is there a point to this sad story? Not you would understand. Land, friends, dignity, all sold to the highest bidder, the United States of America. Even the technology that gave birth to these weapons is Russian, developed by us. What do you intend to do? Russia will rise again. And Ray is the key. I regret to inform you that I have no intention of selling Metal Gear. As I said, I came to take it back. Oh. Yes, returned to the Patriots. The Lale Lule Lo. Lale Lule Lo. You have you sold us out? <laughs> I was never in your employ, Kalukovich. Are you still in league with Solidus? No hard feelings, Colonel. Mother Russia can rot for all I care. Damn. Since when, Ocelot? When did you turn? I'm glad you noticed, comrade. I abandoned her during the Cold War. That's very vague. That's like Metal a 60 year period. For one. It was some time between the day I was born and right you now. Your daughter will die here. Damn you! Uh -oh. Sergey, looks like you were long overdue for retirement. But now, what does Ocelot have as leverage above all the soldiers that have guns on him right now? I guess he doesn't want leverage. Never mind. Although the Marines are still there.
show's over. If you wish to live, I suggest you run now. This ship is still in the lower New York Harbor. You may yet make it to shore if you swim for your life. Yeah, extra slow mo. I think these are these cutscenes are pre-rendered though, so that's why we've been avoiding the slowdown effect. The unintentional slowdown. <laughs> this is a snake out of nowhere. Everyone's like, what the hell? Who's that? Stop. Who are you? You know who I am. I forgot Tell about me. this. Not so young anymore, eh, Snake? You're drowning in time. I know what it's this like, brother. Weird. No wonder Naomi passed you over for the Fox Dive program. Right. So Ocelot has Liquid's arm for some reason, like, and for some reason Liquid's arm is able to take over his brain, right? Because if I remember correctly, by Metal Gear Solid 4, he's basically taken over completely. Few more years and you'll be another dead clone of the old man. Our raw materials are vintage, brother. Big Boss was in his late 50s when they created his copies. But I, I live on through this arm. Liquid's arm. He does live on through that arm, you're right. He just, dude, right when you, you sent that message, Mike, he said it in, for me in the game. That was timing. I'm sure Olga's fine. And so I'm fine. The, the only reason I'm fine with the weird liquids arm storyline is because we we get to hear more of Cam Clark, who was uh, Andre Almeida in Killer Seven. So I'll forgive them this time. They give a sort of reason for the arm thing later on. Oh damn, he just straight up Flashbacks to last time we had to fight liquid inside of a Metal Gear. But we don't have a cybernetic ninja to help us out this time, unfortunately. I think we're in trouble. You guys just had a seven minute speech on how this is the ultimate weapon and nothing could stop it. You guys are shooting bullets at it. You fools. That's how you could tell they weren't paying attention.
Ага. Yeah, they said the new Metal Gear is amphibious, so... Water ain't gonna hurt it. Yo, it's like a laser now? Because Metal, Metal Gear Rex had a... Uh, a rail gun, right? But this is Metal Gear, Gear Ray, which is a little different. Snake. Snake. What if the game over screen popped up? Importantly, the new Metal Gear is capable of performing a backflip. Dive. Damn. Yes, at the location we discussed. Yes, I have photographic evidence of Snake on the scene. The yes. Cypher was most useful. I look forward to tomorrow morning's news flash. I would say the Marine Corps' plans are on indefinite hold. Yes, of course, Mr. President. What the hell? Why would the President need to rob the Marines? If I was the President, I'd be like, dude, don't say that over the intercom. Gosh. I can't believe Snake's dead. Mr. Kennedy. Scientists had to make thousands of calculations to create the atomic bomb to determine its effects. Computers, atomic grounds, both products of World War II grew up together. Information age, people, race technology. At the Smithsonian Institute. Snake, do you remember the sinking of that tanker two years ago? Wait a no, second, that's Colonel. Terrorists blow a hole in an oil tanker full of crude barely 20 miles off the shore of Manhattan. Your classic nightmare. It didn't take long for the government to put an oil fence around the whole mess. And then that massive offshore cleanup facility went up inside. The big shell. I hear the cleanup isn't quite over yet. It takes time. Wait, what? But in the meantime, the shells snake. become a landmark, a symbol of environmental protection. I can't believe they changed Snake's, snake's voice actor partway through, just like in Final Fantasy X. They keep changing voice actors. Approximately six hours ago, the big shell was seized by an armed group. Do we have an ID? Former members of the Navy SEAL Special Anti-Terrorist Training Squad Dead Cell. Russian private army members may also be involved. It's a highly trained group and they have the big shell under complete control. Yeah, it's the new voice actor, Mike, exactly. That is the grandpa from Ben 10. Uh-oh. What's happening? Where 
we're gonna have to figure out what the hell's going on here. Oh, well, uh, it's a, it's an inside joke fact. Don't don't worry. But the main character in uh, Final Fantasy X keeps changing voice actors throughout the game if you play it. I'm I'm simulating the PS2 version, but for some reason it has slowdown during certain moments. I haven't figured out how to fix it. What makes them think they can get that much? There was a government-sponsored tour going on at the Big Shell that day. Hostages, huh? A VIP from one of the major conservation groups, and one from our own government. The most important person in a sense. The most important person? James Johnson. The president? Unless the demands are met, the James Johnson the is the president. Out of the water. That's the most the generic name I've ever heard in my life. Into an inferno. That's not the worst case scenario. If the chlorides being used to decontaminate the seawater go up with the oil, toxins containing catastrophic levels of dioxins will be released. In other words, the bay's ecosystem will be wiped out, and the sea will turn into a toxic soup for centuries, becoming the worst environmental disaster in history. You have two mission objectives. One, infiltrate the offshore decontamination oh. facility Big Shell and safeguard the president and other hostages. And two, disarm the terrorists by any means necessary. Dude, it's Snake. He's back. I thought he died. You should know that SEAL Team 10 is also conducting a rescue operation. Is this a joint effort? No. Foxhound remains a covert body. Don't alert them to your presence. Foxhound is still a thing? Isn't it just Ocelot left at this point? I know inside strut AF shell one. How are things? We're in lock. Looks like there are no sentries posted here. What's the visibility? The lights on the plant struts are functioning. I won't have to use the IR goggles. Any problems? There was a brand new hole cut through the oil fence. There's someone else besides me that wanted to get in badly. That's not possible. Why is well, it going so fast now? They landed on the roof of the big shell as planned. And by the way, Snake, we're changing your code name for all following communication. What's wrong with Snake? Just a precaution. You are now designated Raiden. All right, Raiden. You've already covered infiltration in VR training. I've completed 300 missions in VR. I feel like some kind of legendary mercenary. Okay, we'll skip that part. <laughs> Make sure nobody sees you. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. When you want to use the it's codec, now. push the select button. When we need to reach you, contact you, the codec will beep. When you hear that noise, press the select button. The codex receiver directly stimulates the small bones oh, of I your ear. Oh, I know ear. how it works. No one but you will be able to hear it. All right. I, I disabled the frame changes. limiter because I thought maybe that would help the slow motion, but instead it made it go faster. The big shell. How do I get up to the next level? There's an elevator at the far end of that area. Use that. Sounds good. Your new sneaking suit uses electrofiber technology, a byproduct of fiber optics research. The texture isn't far removed from rubber, but the material protects against a wide range of toxic substances. The suit itself has a wide array of built-in sensors. It is referred to as smart skin in military R&D. Data about damage to different regions of the body, including blood loss, is exchanged between the suit and the intravenous nanomachines to create a feedback system. There's a lot of pressure on my torso. Relax. The suit applies varying pressure to major internal organs to maximize performance. And I'll try to make sure the slowdown issue is fixed the skull by the time I start the next time. Seems appropriate somehow. I've never had that issue before the hatch with, a with PS2 will open uh, into emulated the games. Area. Locate the hatch first. Copy that. Moving on to main mission objectives. All right, so there's the big twist. You only play as as Snake for the first part of the game, and then now now you're right in. It's weird that they were calling him Snake at first. I forgot that that was a thing. Um, 
Got no weapons. Why are they always going with no weapons? Look at that. And now we're riding. Oh wait, how do you save? Because now we don't have... Let's see. Oh no, we need to like find... We need to earn the ability to save. What if I just try to... Let's see. Nope. Damn it. Hideo Kojima, why would you do this? Look at all these bugs. Ew. Look at his POV, he's got like this weird bug vision. There's always items in the water. Actually, I don't know if there are, I can't see now. Oh wait, holy crap, you can actually swim underwater? Got your feet wet? These are the basic controls for I don't stroke. remember that. Stroke the water and move forward by pushing the punch well, I never button. played this. Push it in rapid succession to swim faster. Change your heading with the left analog stick. Up will take you up. Down takes you lower. Left and right to face those directions. The O2 gauge will... Okay, okay, I get the idea. Yeah, so now I am past where I was before. Uh, I had played a little bit of Metal Gear Solid 2 in the past, but I only played the opening part with Snake. So this is just completely new to me. I had no idea that there was, like, swimming in this game. Oh, pardon. Gotta be a ration or something in front of you. There we go. Oh. Someone getting getting beat up in there? Hang on. There's an item over there. Ugh, should we crawl into the bugs? Nasty. Oh geez, I didn't even get out to where the other the other item was. That I meant to do, but it was blocked off. He uh ducks. He gets down a little bit faster than Snake does. Be quick, I'll give him that. He can actually walk- wait, hang on. He was like walking while on his knees. Maybe that's only when you're like against the wall or something. Hello? Raiden, that door is watertight. Yeah, I know how to open it. We covered it in VR training. True. Proceed with caution. Right, and you can't just rely on VR training for everything. Someone just beat that guy up. We heard it earlier. Colonel, I've sighted an enemy sentry. AN-94 and a Makarov. Those grenades, all his equipment is Russian made. Must be a Grelukovich man. Grelukovich? A Russian private army that was in line to work with the Shadow Moses Takeover Group four years ago. What's their stake in this one? They must have made a deal, an arrangement with the terrorists. Not the terrorists. They become a band of mercenaries, an army without a country. Oh, that's right. He does like a cartwheel instead of a. Like a dive.
Wait a second. That looked familiar. Colonel, there's definitely another intruder in here besides me. That's not a possibility. Not a team. Looks like a solo job. One man. We may not know who he is, but he managed to take care of every sentry in the area. They're all out cold. Whoever he is, he's got some skills. We need to get an ID. But for now, you can take advantage of the situation and get to work. There's a terminal in front of the elevator. A node. Did you say nerd? Not nerd. <laughs> Did you node. say nerd? Oh. Use the node to gain access to the Big Shell's facilities network. Then what? Pull up the map of the structure. That'll let you activate the Soliton radar. The Soliton radar? True. That radar came in useful during VR training. A radar system uses biological magnetic fields as input. These estimated enemy positions are projected onto a map according to reference points collected via GPS signals and field personnel reports. We need to get to the map through the Big Shell's node to put this data processing to practical use. Uh -huh. The node unit is about three feet high, should be colored blue. Each blue. area has at least one. Blue nodes, gotcha. How do I gain access? Just push the action button in front of the node. Yeah, how do the I save the game? Your body will take care of the like security to do clearance that. and allow you access to the node. Complete the procedure before those sentries gain consciousness. If they spot you, you won't be able to gain access for a while. Stay on guard. Got it. I don't have a Otacon or a Mei Ling to save progress. I just have one kernel to tell me about nerds or something. Raiden, you won't be able to use any of the enemy's equipment. Why not? You should know that all active weapons are equipped with a personal identification system. Wow. The owner enters their required user ID information during the weapon registration or at the start of a mission. If anyone other than the registered I user forgot tries about to that. fire the weapon, because isn't that a thing in four as well? Authorize the action. But these are black and four, I think it goes even weapons. farther. I think it's like a with identification nano machine. They must thing have been customized by the terrorists themselves. These are professionals we're dealing with, and they certainly won't let their own equipment be used against them. I'm guessing it's the same for the Navy SEALs gear. Right. How am I supposed to procure weapons then? Find the ones that haven't yet been individualized. Everything you find in the item box is clean. You should know this from your VR training. Okay, I know those. Items in the item box are reused at will, blah, blah, blah. What? It's weird that like this is doing like a tutorial after we just did an opening thing as Snake, which a lot of the things they're teaching us here, it's like you would have had to figure that out already to get through. I wonder if this was originally intended to be first and then the snake part. Ouch. Was that supposed to happen? Oh. Uh. Was I supposed to know what name to put in? Did I miss something? I don't know when Raiden was born. He was born on the 4th of July, of course. The B. Huh? Menu options? The heck? Good work, Raiden. The radar should be functioning now. 
Remember your VR training sessions. The tool is exactly the same one. It maps the terrain as well as the position of enemy personnel. The bright dot in the middle is you riding. The red dots are your This is weird. Why are they explaining what we had to already learn? Oh, who's this? Jack, can you hear me? Rose, not supposed to be involved. What's going on? Jack, I'm part of this mission. What the hell's going on? Meet the mission analyst. She'll be overseeing the data saving and support. Why her? Foxhand analyst that was supposed to take part in the mission was in an accident. Rosemary was brought in as a replacement. An accident. According to the file, she knows you better than anyone else. Rose may be in the service, but an intelligence analyst is no field officer. Not to worry, she has our technical staff at her disposal. She's never been a part of the field mission. This is insane. I have my own reasons for selecting her for the mission. I failed to see. Your VR training performance is in and out. Sometimes that's not enough. Are you familiar with the Shadow Moses incident? I covered it in VR. That's so funny because wasn't VR missions a thing that you could do in Shadow Moses? So it's like he played all those VR missions. How are the operatives will to survive? I was trained to fight. My personal feelings have no place in the mission. We've learned it doesn't work that way. In the field, you need all the help you could get. Jack, you're so stuck with me whether you like it or not. Rose, you need someone to watch your back. Oh my god. I can't. I would have just listened to it. Okay, she lets you save. Good. You know what day is tomorrow? April 30th. Is there something special about it? Isn't that Tom Fulp's birthday? It's Pico Day. April 3rd is Pico Day. That's what's special about it. I can't remember. I'm sorry. Oh, well, I'll keep trying until I hear the answer. I'm going to let you go now, Jack. Take care. The only reason I started skipping that is because he was explaining how the map worked, which we already figured it out. I didn't expect a new character to pop up suddenly. Raiden, the enemy sentry is regaining consciousness. Be careful, Jack. Find somewhere to hide until the elevator arrives. You must stay out of sight. Okay, let me save. What's up, Jack? So we have a new character who uh, lets us save. Can I just choke this guy out? Oops. Enemy sighted. Requesting backup unit. Dude, I knocked that guy out in one dive. Oh my gosh. It's so much harder to hit people with the cartwheel than it is with snakes. Dive, I feel like. We'll, we'll, we'll probably wrap up in a bit here. That way I could try to... The terrorists call themselves Sons of Liberty. Sons of Liberty. Oh, so that's who the Sons of Liberty are. Leader is Solid Snake. Wait, what? Snake's a terrorist? The hero of Shadow Moses? So that's why you changed my code name. Right, but he can't be the Solid Snake. You mean the Solid he Snake? Died two years ago uh. on that tanker after he blew it sky high. Could he have survived? Not a chance. I can't believe Snake's officially there. Colonel, I'm on the roof. There are no sentries, but it would only take one to spot me in this light. You never had daylight VR training after all. Stay extra sharp until you can find a node to log in from. What about the commandos? SEAL Team 10 has landed on struts B and C. And the president? Seems he was spotted on strut B. Strut B? Strut B. Oh boy. This is not good. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe I should just wrap it up. This is gonna be a problem. Skip that. First, okay. get to a node. 
I'll just continue because I just saved it uh, before we went out here. Holy crap, look at this map. Either I, I'll just save right here actually. Um It's a weird 3D map, I wasn't expecting that. Jack, is that you? And I'll try to I'll try to take care of that slowdown issue. So next time we, we uh I'll probably stream this tomorrow. Unless Super Mario RPG comes tomorrow in the mail, it's unlikely because it, it was shipped today, but there's a chance, but more likely it's going to come on Saturday, so I'll probably play more of this tomorrow. I'll try to make sure that it's, uh, it's not having that slowdown issue. Jack, do you remember what day tomorrow is? That again. Pico day. I'm sorry, but I still don't have a clue. That's okay. What is it, Rose? Talk to me. I'd rather you figure it out. It's important. How important? Important enough, and we'll talk about it tomorrow. Why not now? Tomorrow seems more appropriate. I need all the help I can get so that I won't chicken out anyway. Is that the reason you decided to be part of this mission? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna finish this thing by tomorrow no matter what. You know I'll do everything I can to help you. Rose, there's something I need you to do as an analyst. What is it? It has to do with Solid Snake. The leader of this takeover incident is claiming that he's Snake himself. The legendary mercenary? Hmm. I need as much data on him as possible. Everything they have on him after the Shadow Moses incident. He's dead now, isn't he? Yes. Should be a burial record somewhere, too. You should be able to request top-level security clearance from the Colonel. That should get us into the most classified material. I'm on it. I'll contact you as soon as I find out something. All right, I'm gonna wrap up for now. So we got past the uh, the opening part, and then we're right in now. Everyone's favorite. So we'll uh, we'll continue from here next time. But thanks everyone for joining. Hope you have a great night. Catch you.